Okay, so here's a bit of a story. And I'm going to be including this in the YouTube part, if I remember. Um, remind me, me, future me, keep this, keep this in the recording. Has to be kept in. In fact, I need to put an alarm. I need to put an alarm uh, that says for me to keep this in. Okay, so the story goes. I don't think I actually told anyone how my computer started crashing. It started crashing while playing um, They Are Billions. When, uh, when a... Uh, one of the last swarms during a uh, an attack, uh, a, a, one of the uh, missions started, it would hang the PC and then it would blue screen. The first couple of times that like, mini swarms were happening, it was that kind of going weird, it would lose focus, it would go down to the desktop, but the game would still be running and it would come back. And I was like, oh, this is getting weird. And it started happening more and more and more throughout the, the game. I had saved i changed some things because i've just moved and i installed new software and stuff i thought oh well, there's lots of things it could be let me try sorting everything out uh, i took the whole pc apart cleaned everything put it back together all the sorts of things the steps you do as normal to try and sort things out the reason why i was recording they are billions that day was because i had had a an absolutely darling message um from a certain uh serena uh, telling me that her boyfriend was a fan of the channel and uh, it was his 27th birthday and that she what well, they'd agreed that they weren't going to be um, getting anything for each other uh, money wise you know they weren't going to be buying presents but she still wanted to get something for him and she so she figured that uh, she'd reach out and see if I would do a little birthday wish for her uh, a bit of a birthday shout out um just because, you know, uh, he was a fan, and so I asked him, oh, sure, I'd, I'd love to. That's a really, really lovely idea. You know, what series is he interested in? And uh, it was Kenshi and They Are Billions. So that, I was I was literally recording that video, uh, and it was dedicated to him and everything. I was so annoyed that my computer broke. For obvious reasons. It's how I make my money. It's how I pay my rent. It's how I feed my ferret. But there was, there was a big chunk of me that was really annoyed because I was like, ah, oh, I'm going to miss his birthday now. That has really been on my mind ever since. Um, it, it pains me that I didn't think to turn the first stream into like a, a birthday shout out for him. But honestly, I just wasn't even thinking in, in, in that, it, like streaming and recording were two separate things. Also, this wasn't the series that, that I was planning to record in. And, and I, was, I was kind of nervous about doing it, if I'm perfectly honest. And so there was lots of reasons why it, it just didn't occur to me. I'm kicking myself now. Because at this point, we're like two weeks away in terms of YouTube uploads before this goes up on the channel. I don't know if, uh, if Chris watches my, my streams. But in case you are here, Chris, happy birthday, mate, from Serena and from myself and all of the dapplings, I am sure. I hope you had a wonderful birthday. I am so sorry that I wasn't able to wish you happy birthday at the time that I'd hoped to, as in on your birthday. But uh, nevertheless, I hope you had a, an amazing one. <sighs> Welcome back. Now, if I've been a good dab, I can not cut out uh, the birthday wishes that are almost certainly way too, too late at this point, uh, then that is good. Um, if I have, uh, well, I guess people are going to tell me in the comments. In fact, yeah, shout at me in the comments if I have forgotten to include a birthday shout out. If you have no idea what kind of birthday or whose birthday or, or what I'm talking about, then it's indicative that I have, in fact, been a bad avoc. And I should feel bad, and in fact, I do. Right, okay, so. Collect all the, uh, the, um, appreciation. I'm not sure if, if accruing appreciation now is worth anything. Uh, that's an interesting one. I don't know. Got anything in here I can grab? Yeah, I'm gonna take these, and I'm gonna grab that. Actually, didn't someone want wheat? I don't recall. I'm gonna take out the wheat just in case, though. Just in case. Now, as I said in the in the uh, announcement, we're going to be building for the first part of this stream. There's a few things I need to take care of, namely our bathhouse and uh, our, our night soil production facilities. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Right. So I'm going to need some parts. The first thing I want is a way for my peeps to actually move around. We're going to be renovating quite a few structures in this little bit. 
Let me grab a building block, a wooden walkway to amble along. I get five of them for two wood. It's fine. I'm going to grab... Oh, I'm going to grab 20 of them, sure. 100 planks. Bonk. That'll do quite nicely. I'm going to need some more trees, though, at that point. So let's go out here and knock those down. For those um, wondering, yes, Siri is 100% still in the party. Nope. You are a non-threat, as long as I keep moving. Nope, not happening. I'm out here to get wood, not to clobber ghosts. Leave me alone. Need more stuffs. No. Nope. Leave us alone. We don't want to play. Mind you, that must be very, very sad for the ghost. I just want someone to play with. Maybe you should stop trying to play with them with your side then. People are far, far more likely to hang around and, and uh, do fun things with you if you're not trying to murder them. Unsuccessfully. Repeatedly unsuccessfully. Oh, wait, no. Did the ghost ever kill me once? Uh, it's on my own head, if, if that was the case. Okay, let's have a look. Uh, right, let me head back to town so I can read chat in the safety of not being killed by a ghost. Very important safety. Right, I'm going to just stand here while people are grabbing stuff. Okay, let's have a quick look. Kenneth, thank you very much for the cheer there. And... Uh, Doom Tuesday! Enjoy this and continue enjoying the game. I'm so excited for you to meet all sorts of characters from it, especially the next town. I'm really looking forward to it. Thank you so much for that tip. That was incredibly kind of you. And Vanya! This year is in honour of my late grandfather, World War II vet and eccentric chemist. Ooh. Once gave uh, uh, me a graduation gift. Oh, sorry, I was trying to read that as a, as a, uh, as a some sort of uh, I, I don't know, like uh, honorific or something. Uh, me graduation gift towards the first computer I ever bought. Oh, thank you so much, Va uh, Vanya. That's so, so kind of you. So kind of you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, I'm very well, uh, thank you for asking. But no, that was it was incredibly kind of you, Vanya. What a, what a wonderful, wonderful uh, message along with that as well. Well, I mean, at least at least the peeps do have plenty of places they can go. They're, they're making two orderly lines, at least. I mean, I, I, it could be worse, I suppose. This guy has become very spoily shaded. Has it? Oh, had it? Was that not just a... <gasps> oh, very good point. Yep, that wasn't just a... a uh, Hey, Sunrise, that was, in fact, spores. Spores everywhere. Can I wallop this while it's there? No, I can't. That's a shame. Give you as well. It's really quite frustrating that it's knocking out all the blocks, but uh, let's get these out of my inventory for now. We need... Sorry, I'm on a bit of a... I hope I'm not missing any important messages in chat. But I've got to get all of this done rather quickly. Okay, let's make sure that these rooms are back in the right place. Any more of those horrid spores around? Wow. People really enjoyed the nosh today. We've got a load of, of uh, gratitude in there. And again... One of the things I really love about this game, and honestly, other builder games like it could could uh, do with taking a, uh, a leaf out of this book, is that there is a purpose to building, a purpose to having the nicer food, a purpose to building a toilet, as weird as that sounds. Um, no, I'm really enjoying this. Super enjoying it. Alright, I think that's good enough. Now, if I place this down, how does it get placed? It just does go on the floor. Okay, that's fine. Uh, I'm fine with this. Is there any kind of... Can I make this regular earth instead? Um, 
Uh, let's have a look. What kind of blocks have I got? Have I got regular earth? Yeah, I've got loads of earth. I could instead, though, make a some grass and make it a lawn. Can't get it from there. Some nuts up. Everyone else should be able to handle the monsters. Nuts up. They're taking a lot of damage just getting through here. That's fantastic. It distracted the skeletons so long that they didn't manage to do damage running the walls. There's not really much reason for me to get involved. You're annihilating them. Do my own peeps get hurt? Or are they pathing through? They are pathing through it. Oh, that's fantastic. Well done, peeps. Uh, do we have any regular brambles? I've got an, one big bramble there and I've got 17 smaller brambles. Did I lose a big bramble anyway? No, I didn't. Well, oh, that was awesome. Right, let's have a quick look through chat. Evil pink spores that breathe poison. Yes. Um, let's see. Where could I put these spores? Uh, these brambles. And if I put them along this path... It is going to limit how close we can get to fighting anything, but at the same time, it is going to you know, potentially hurt our enemies at that little bit more. Okay. I could do this a little bit better, or rather safer with first person. What we can do is have another wall out front, perhaps. Really? Is that strictly necessary? Now I'm back to doing uh, two hits on the slimes, which is a little bit embarrassing. But anyway. That occasional insta-kill is still really useful, I think. Little by little, Avak making his base inaccessible, even to himself. Well, I don't access it from that side, too. Uh, right, I want some... Uh, grass seeds. Yeah, I'll have three of these. And then night no, cell. So uh, sorry, yeah, two sacks of fertilizer. Yep, no, we're good. All right, these can go away. Right, what I would like now: try not to damage anything, please. Let's uh, place this down. Where's the border on it? Right, so it's how many tiles forward? One, two, three, four, five. And then one over here as well. I'll probably do the trick. This whole area, I think. Yep. Ah, damn it, we missed the spot. That's kind of annoying. There we go. Making this place right lush. Uh, we'll pop one over here as well. Ah, damn it, missed that spot too. It's good enough for now. Uh, right. So, we want to pop down these boards. Oh, i struck. There you go. That's wonderful. Can we possibly get this area moved? We are getting some flowers around, actually. Let's just get this all the way down. And then clean this up a bit. Place it on top, that's fine. I mean, it's not perfect by a long shot, but uh, it'll do. It's a bit of a path. Shows them where they need to go. I could have part of that path also head on up here, perhaps. Up to the steps, at the very least. Colty Bear, thank you very much for the 17 months. It's been a while since I could catch a stream. Hope all is well in the new home. Uh, yeah, that, I mean... The, the whole PC thing notwithstanding, things are actually pretty good. Thank you very much for asking. 
I really would like that to have been uh, Earth, but I guess I'm just going to have to accept that it is not going to be beautiful, beautiful, um, lush green. We'll just pop that there for now. That'll do. Doesn't strictly need to be anything else there. Rui, thank you very much for the 30 seconds month. Thank you so much. And to not a rogue AI. I, I, I will always love that name. Hey, Alec. Seems I only managed to ca catch you live monthly. Hope all... Uh, it, it's all been dapper lady. Uh, yeah, by and large. Certainly can't complain. I mean, you can't, could, but uh, it would be, be very silly to complain. Ah. Right, okay, so we're, we're actually getting this place looking really nice now. Really, really nice. Okay, where's the border of this village? Really? Here? Hmm. Okay, so this is the real end of it. That's kind of a big issue. <sighs> Don't worry, everyone. I'm going to get it all sorted. I promise. Need blocks. Um, all right. I think what we need is to actually lower all this down. I'm not sure what type of tile I'm going to use for this, but I want a bit of a larger area back here for a restaurant. And on top of that, a bathhouse. So I want to dig uh, a sort of basement, I guess, for the restrooms. Because I want to experiment with being able to make a restroom basically with stalls. So we've got more room in there. That should be enough room in general. Now I am going to want this to lead down. I'll probably have the door in on this side though. I'm thinking, yeah, a double door leading down. Now how much, uh, that wouldn't quite, oh no, it would give me enough, maybe a single door. It would give me enough room for a two by two small cubicle on each side. Um, Sure. Sure, I kind of like that idea. Uh, we're going to need to sink this down once more, though. So much beautiful, purified earth. I'm very, very happy. Thank you very much, Wiggly. Yes, Leafin, they are eating a lot of cabbage. Uh, so, you know, if you're wondering why they all need to use the toilet so much, well, there's your your answer. That's 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 what I'm assuming anyway. I'm assuming it's all down to that, the the cabbage. Way too much cabbage being consumed. Hello, Tiberian kid. Good. And a little bit of everything. Whomp. Be done. We're gonna run this right up to the edge of the the area, the very furthest point, which will still be considered part of the town. Now I'm, I'm still not sure how that mechanic works specifically, but I'm uh, hoping we'll we'll be able to work it out a little bit as time goes on. I'm gonna take this down one more layer. Uh, as for the time being, I'm sort of. Uh, intending to have this be more of a we will have several small bathrooms I will I will give a shot and see if I can make one larger um, single room with with multiple kind of stalls but I don't know if that's gonna work so I'm building this basement or rather digging this basement with a view to building many small technically rooms unto themselves so that even if my initial plan doesn't work this work uh, of digging hasn't been for naught. Okay. It's been a whole day of digging a basement for me. Oh, no. okay. Let me just dig through this in the old fashion way. Yep. 
crap. Done and done. So, I'm thinking probably just regular floorboards for now would be the better option. Uh, I need to be able to get out though, so... Ava is absolutely starving. Well, you know. Oh my lord. Uh, I think that only a very small amount of our community is actually managing to uh, get any uh, any washing done. That will also be part of this build. That is definitely a big part that I'm, I'm looking to do. I'm going to have a, a second story, which will be the bathhouse itself. Uh, I've already got plenty of these. Uh, what I do need is a lot more of these, I would say. Um... I've already got loads of those as well. Now, wooden fencing, horizontal logs, vertical logs, basic bridges. Uh, let's get a lot. Actually, let's get another hundred of these. I'm probably going to need more than a hundred, honestly, but we'll see how it goes. And also a hundred of these. I've actually given every villager their own apartment with a kitchen and a bathroom. Ah, uh, no. No. There is not nearly enough room in this place for me to do that. I don't think, anyway. Maybe there is. Maybe, maybe I'm just being a scallywag by refusing such a, a, a fair request. But, oh well. Alright, let's see. Gonna want the flooring there. Going to want... Uh, the floorboards. Going to want. Where's my. Oh, my hardware's already up on there. Ah, it's better. Uh, hardware's already up there as well. So, first and foremost, let's uh, build out the wall section. Again, this will allow me to have a, a bunch of rooms along here, even if my initial idea doesn't work out for me. would generally prefer to have a doorway there, though. Good, but this one. Oh. And it, and it. Ah, damn it. There we go. Ah, I'm messing this up, something chronic. Might be easier to do this in third person. In fact, it almost certainly will. The arrow shows which direction they will build out in. And it seems that it can build four blocks. So, yeah. First person mode really does help. I'm not even sure it's just four blocks. I think it might be a little bit more than that. Oh dear. Yeah, it's definitely not just four blocks. Whoever said that was uh, quite clearly mistaken. Oh. Okay, fine. Well, uh, take this out. I do still need a way out, I suppose, but uh, for the time being, we will get this built back. Now, I would like mm, probably this one for now. Reminds you of FTD building. Ah, uh, yeah, I suppose so. I have made a bit of a mistake in my placements here. Uh, we will have to see how this works. As I have not accounted for the right number of blocks. I didn't account for the internal rooms. Uh, the internal walls, rather. So let's hope that the stalls will work out. Uh, because if not, then ugh, I'm going to have to dig this much bigger. Or have far fewer stalls in here than I wanted. That being said... Ah, no, no, no. That's naughty. Please and thank you, no. I might have to get Marla to help me. 
Let's see if I can't get an insta kill on this thing. That'd be awesome. Not leaving up here. Let's keep going. Oh wow. Those uh those thrusts. Getting some pretty decent attacks there. And it's down. Still worth a decent amount of EXP. Now I'm at level 10, which is maximum for me here, I'm assuming. I'm assuming that changes based on uh, where you go. Uh but actually, yeah, yeah, we we could definitely have stairs here. And just have the stairs out on this side. Yeah, I like that. I'm I'm gonna change this up a little bit from my original plan. Partially through necessity. Uh, let's go ahead and grab some stairs. Please don't attack me. Ow, that was so rude. My lord. I was just building. There you go. Insta kill. That's what you get when you dip your your sword in poop. Don't don't ask. Please. Uh, right. Let's get a doorway. Will exist about here. I'm gonna say. Uh, no. Help. Haha! -ha! Let it straight to the lights. That is a pretty good reason to have lights all over your base. It seems. Do you not sleep, Avak? Uh, no, not not really. Uh, Tiberian Kid, thank you very much for the resub. And to Nexus... Uh, Nexus... Nexus Odd Nothing? I'm, I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing your name right. A gift from me and my cat, who is sitting on my head. Oh, that's fantastic. Solidarity with those whose pets sit on their, their noggin. Siri basically rides me. She sits on my head and is quite happy to stay there forever. <sighs> I am basically just a mode of transport for Siri. There we go. Let's get this sorted. I want the threshold of this place to be a little bit... What? Oh, I was going straight down. Okay. Well, that was bad for me. Now... Uh, you know what? Let's let's try this whole thing of jump block. Haha, -ha, it works! You can nerd pole in this. It wasn't lying to me after all. There we go. Now then. My initial idea was to have a couple of little stalls. Uh I could still do that. And I could have these blocks as the entry points. Yeah. And then another... Actually, yeah, I could ha end up with three separate stalls if I do it this way. Um, sure. These are quite spacious little, bar uh, little rooms as well. It will give me more opportunity to put down um, some nice uh, uh, decorations in there. Okay, what kind of decorations do I have? Uh, specifically. Can I keep this? Uh, actually, do I have any nice just flooring? Chalk? No, I don't think so. Maybe this, just to have a bit of a different look to it. Yeah, actually, I like that. And yes, I am spending the entire first part of the stream building toilets. If you have a problem with that, take it up with my residents, who are constantly having the queue. When they desperately, desperately need to poop instead of queue. Uh, let's have a look. You're hoping for a four-seater. My lord. Xenovoy, thank you very much for the bit, mate. Sanitation is important. Yep. Sanitation is very important. Alright, gonna need some uh, chamber pots. I am really tempted, though. Okay, understand that I am not going to do what it's going to look like I'm going to do. I'm for science in this, and science is always a, a worthy goal. Okay, just accept 
that we need to know for science. Uh, rust. Can I put farming tools in? <laughs> Maybe I could make it a rustic bathroom. Uh, decorate your dwelling with these fa uh, farmhouse tools. Uh, <laughs> I'm not going to put bread in there, am I? Uh, lopped lengths of dry lumber, fit for uh, even a fledgling fire starter. Uh, rope. Cloth sacks. Sure, I'll grab them just because I can. I don't believe they are required items for a poop place. So I'll only take them. Now, well, if each one got a door, maybe. If I just drew a straight line there. And then I could just have a tiny, literally just a tiny little stall. But... Uh, I also need those. Uh, but... Oh, well, actually, that's not a bad idea, I suppose. Uh, let me grab the... The was. Just in case. Just in case we go with your idea. But that would mean that they wouldn't get uh, light, light in their, their poop areas. Which I can only assume would be a detriment. Nexus, thank you very much for the subscription. That's very kind of you. Uh, Alright. Let's pop this down. Dunk. I'll make a room, I hope. Oh, it made this into a room as well. Three tiny rooms. Now, I need to know. And I'm sorry for doing this. This should make it into a bathroom. Tiny toilet. I'll be honest, I'm I'm just glad. I'm 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 honestly happy. I'm happy that the game said no. No, that's that's not how we do in this game. Might be how you do in other games. But that is not something that we're going to allow in this game. Well done, game. Uh, let's uh, take that away. We do want a stall right there. Kind of like uh, going with that design, in a way. This one, though. Oh, what do I do here, though? Because well, maybe this would be a really fancy, fancy place. A fancy place for fancy people. Uh, right. Yep. Yep. Let's grab you out of the way. Yep. I've got to take yep. this out. In first person mode, I'm not going to be able to see it properly. Straw floors. And two there, and regular wooden floorboards. Kind of looking nice, I think. Get these out of the way. Yeah, I'm reasonably happy with this one. And we'll have one one very large, very swanky toilet. And everyone's going to have to fight for the for that one. Uh, but, but uh, yeah, this is going to give us more than enough. I mean, they are tiny rooms, though. But, I mean, he did... Uh, he had asked specifically for tiny rooms when we set up toilets. So... I'm not sure if it's really necessary to have them like that, but... I guess it doesn't hurt. That should give us... A bunch of toilets. Let's have a look in here. 
Is this a room? Oh no, they're not. They're not big enough to be toilets. Damn. Ah, uh, okay, I missed that. I missed that it was changing the designation. Or maybe they're just going to have to be uh, three wide then. I mean, it's not the worst thing in the world. Oh well. It was it was worth the experimentation. Uh, I need to pay more attention. <laughs> Story of my life. Small toilet. Pump. I'll get rid of this. Uh, I'll pop the towel rails elsewhere. Uh, I'll have two towel rails there and there. And a lamp as well. I don't this These sacks could be full of... Oh, no, they're, they're a bit big. Uh, but I'm thinking they could be full of uh, smelling salts. Uh, whatever it takes to mask the smell. Yeah, yeah, these will, these will, the tiny toilet now, I think. Pop that there. Maybe a lamp as well. Then we're good. Jobs are good in at that point. There we are. It's actually not a bad little move, in my humble opinion. This one needs to, unfortunately, move back to where it was before. People already rushing in to make use of the new loo. Marvellous. Why am I breaking? I am breaking the door. Yep. Did someone just groan? Ah, uh. oh, my lord. That was awkward. Super awkward. This should not be a toilet. Please stop. My lord. No, don't come in here when I'm building. Uh, on your own head be it at that point. I take no bloody responsibility for this. Not even a slight amount of... No! 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 Oh my goodness, why? No, please excuse me. Uh, why? I'm just trying to make a nice environment for you. I got this in there. Maybe. Hmm. I really not place it. Oh, right. There we are. Second toilet done. And just so that it breaks everyone's brain, I'm not going to change the uh, orientation of this one. Uh, this one will just be the odd one out. And yes, I know, it hasn't like made her a rustic loo or anything like that, but... Ah, that's fine. There we go. I think they're now sorted. We've got three toilets in here now. And collect the night soil. I really didn't think I was going to make much use of uh, first person, but no, genuinely, it's actually quite useful. Uh, no, don't need it. I apparently never need to poop. Thankfully. Ah, hey, Casa, how are you doing, Cariad? I no, I'm collecting night soil, Leafin. That's one hundred percent not that. Gobble down some crap. Oh, wrong things. Nope. 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 Right, okay, so that's, uh, in my opinion, an upgrade. Upgraded lose for everybody. Uh, now, though, what I would like is to have. Um, well, I could make the rooms a bit taller, but there's... I'm not sure really if there's much reason for that. If I place these down like this, will they change orientation? No, they don't. That's a shame. Because uh, I wouldn't have minded that one, actually. Uh, right, let's uh, put some lamps around. Hopefully okay. uh, we can have one above the A instead, and it'll look a little bit better. There we are. 
Now then, um... I am going to place these down. Just to give this structure a bit of shape at the back. I don't believe that these areas will be considered part of the town. But it'll give it a, give it a bit of a, a different feel and look to it. Uh, we are going to have a door here. Not sure what else we're going to do. Maybe, maybe I could put in some windows at the back. Just to... Uh, get of smell, I guess. Uh, you got to think about these things. I'm a real builder, not, not one of these fake builders. Now they're all queuing for the bathroom. Don't worry, we'll get to that soon. I need to go make myself some more builders. Uh, windows, though. <laughs> Behold the dookie dungeon. Can't see immortal. <sighs> Bye. Uh, if you make them two by two, you can fit one more in, I think. I, I probably could, but I would need to change the position of the stairs, which I'm not presently willing to do. But thanks for the, uh, the suggestion, though. Um, sure. Let's, uh, oh, I'm gonna need more wood. Okay. Back in a moment. Uh, hey, Bubbles! Well, why, why do you focus on only the bad? Yes, I am building people toilets, and yes, I did make my occasionally insta-kill sword out of people's poop, but that isn't all that this game is. And have you know, just a thing that occasionally, you know, is... A, yeah. It's not like that isn't even, you know, uh, hasn't got any precedent in history. Either. Yeah, one of those just died instantly. You saw the the, the red and black part of the thing. Um, it's quite a lot of precedent for that kind of those kinds of shenanigans in history. Quite a lot of duels were were fought with soiled weapons, so that uh, even a non-lethal wound would become infected. And, and honestly, an infection was much more lethal back then than a wound. There we go. Blackney, this is all I've seen of this game. Oh. Yeah, probably not giving it the best... Uh, <laughs> the best representation then right now. Using a hammer to trap down trees. No, 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 this is a builder's hammer. Totally, totally different kind of thing. There yeah, instant kill. I mean, that one's almost an instant kill just because it's so good. No. Ah, damn it. Actually, I was able to avoid a much worse attack by uh, being knocked back there. Yeah? Malroth is significantly more capable in combat than I am. If you're wondering about the uh, the number differences. Like this, you monster! I almost feel like you should be talking, saying that to me, given that I'm just killing these really cute little slimes. Alright, there's loads of gratitude in there. I don't know if there's any point in me collecting it at this point, but uh, I'm going to continue doing so. And it looks like our cooks have uh, set up breakfast. Someone's going to get some candy. Someone's going to get uh, cooked scallywinkle. Someone a nice green salad. More candies. A uh, uh, crab claw. Yeah, it's going to be quite a nice, uh, nice breakfast, I think, for everyone. Our cooks are hard at work. I am going to make a better um, uh, cook area. Kitchen area, rather, that that will be connected a bit better, I think. Oh, right, I didn't make the, the windows yet. Uh, okay. Let's see. I'll give you more than enough arched windows. Thank you. It does boggle my mind a little bit that they're still completely okay with using this area, despite the fact that, more or less, anyone can see in right now. And that is kind of why I don't feel bad about putting in windows right here. Um, but given that, I am going to move this around. It was symmetrical in a sense, but I've got a better position for it now. What, I can collect the night soul from up here? That almost makes me not want to change it. Uh, 
Right, let's go for the floorboards. That would be a ghost. Not someone suffering from uh, cabbage related bowel complications. Right, I need more floorboards. Though at this stage, I may well look for a different kind of wood texture that I could use here. I'm just really l uh, light on different textures that I can I can make. Later on, I'm sure it expands out, but right now, struggling a bit. No, I guess I'm going to go and get some more floorboards in. Um, that said, I could have like a feature wall on this side. Yeah, sure, actually. And by the same token, we can have that feature wall extend inside as well. Oh, I'm sorry, Siri. My bad. Siri's now sleeping in the toilet. Oops. It's fine. I'm sure she'll forgive me. Can I find some pumpkin seeds? Give me a second, I'm building you a better bathhouse. Oh lord. So demanding. Yeah, I am going to build a roof. I know, I know. They're, they're, they're quite often a pain, but... Uh... Yeah, I would want the roof. See, this section is going to have to be basically locked in to allow passage for the upstairs area, which is going to be where we build the bathhouse. Um, look, I, I know that this is going to make a couple of people raise their eyebrows, but sh shush. I need to make use of these blocks while I've got them. Yep. Am I gonna need more? I think so. Oh no! Haha! -ha! Fantastic. I approve. Nope. Thank you. Insta kill. Perfect. Uh, right. Now then, I am going to flesh out this side with a roof. And I will probably build over the loose over here. I'm not sure what type of flooring I'm going to be using that for that, but... And on this side, the type of door I want is... Do I have a cloth door? I don't think I do. Uh, actually, let me stow all of these seeds. Uh, I don't need them on my person. I'm putting them in the barn, and then my peeps can make use of the barn to plant. They can tend the crops themselves, then. We lost a, a load. Uh, when... Actually, I've got a load of stuff in here that I need to move out. Let's grab all of this. Uh, the sugar cane seedlings, yes. The kelp, no. Uh, all right. I'm going to need to drop off. Let's pop these things in my inventory for now. Let me go to changing pots. Now, what I would like is anything that even looks like a seed. I wonder if I can I can make an area um, grow for growing grass specifically. That'll be interesting. I want only the seeds. Yep, I think that's all. Actually, I don't. I I would be very surprised if if those grass seeds could be used like that. Instead, I'm going to plunk this down and hope, 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 that it works. 
Will that cause grass? No, it doesn't cause the grass up here. That's a shame. But I've got enough seeds that it doesn't matter. Okay. So, uh... I'm gonna build this floor out like so. So now the lava trees actually have a roof. And I feel significantly less bad about this situation. There we are. Right. I am probably going to want to have the bathhouse. Actually, well, I can't have it go further back, but I could have it come further forward. If... But for the fact that the bell is going to be in the way. That is going to be genuinely a problem for me. Uh, let's tidy this up. And tidy this up down here. Sorted. Really, Bilal, people are crapping their hearts out. I mean, I have to admit that is actually really, really fantastically good. But at the same time, why? Why do you do this? Why? Oh, my lord. You hurt me, Belial. Hurt my soul. Right, there we go. Actually, maybe I should have the roof up one more tile. As that would give me a better position to put down my uh, baths. Yes, I did waste some hammer blows, but thankfully there's no durability on my uh, hammer, so it doesn't really matter. Now, I don't know how long bits last around here, but it's fine. Open that up. Go in and grab this. Some more night soil. Well, at the very least, the lavatory... Um, <laughs> the lavatory constipation issue actually kind of fitting way to describe that, I suppose. Uh, is solved. At the very least, that is now no longer a problem for us. Uh, I'm thinking that we, at this stage, are going to swap the walls out. So this one. And I really want to try and have this expand outwards so it's supported on these beams instead. Um, if I stand here, is the town village music going to stop? No. If I stand here, does it stop? No. Here. Oh! Oh, these support beams could go even further back. Well, well, well. Hmm. In that case, this is going back as well. Because the moment you stop hearing the music, that's with the town boundary, and I'm not sure how buildings interact with the town boundary yet. I should for science it, I suppose. But I don't really want to right now. Uh, that is a wall there. Oop. This is a wall there. Oop. Avec, the easy way to check if you are inside the boundary of the town is the lower level indicator in the top left. Ah, right, yeah. I see. Very, very good. Can you please stop spitting at my dog? That's what you get. Instant death. You brought it on yourself. You frankly deserved that, and you know you did. The slimes didn't, but they're going to pay for it anyway. Right. 
So, with that done... We can draw this out all the way along to the supports. Do I want the supports to be that though? Um, no, I don't want the supports to be made of this. I want the supports to continue to be uh, wooden logs. I think that will look a bit better. I love how I was able to hammer something to destruction through a block. That is some expert builder level hammering right there. There we go. Now then, with that in place, we can oh, we can use an awful lot of these. I'm gonna need so many more of these blocks. Damn it. I'm all fingers and thumbs, it appears. All clear. Are you commenting on the fact that there's no night soil for me to collect, or are you saying that it's safe? Because that could easily be taken multiple ways. Yeah, perfect. Now, I'm almost tempted to have a little area out here just to kind of move forward even further and be fully supported between these two supports here. With a window in just for prettiness sake. I am still building with a very limited palette, I guess you could say. But I'm pretty happy with what I'm able to get done. I'm going to have to make a entryway down here, I'm thinking. So I need to consider how I'm going to have this uh, entryway come up into this structure. But likewise, I suppose I could have these blocks built up on the outside over here. Another one over here. Perhaps. Okay. People all rushing in. Help me! Well, why did you pick the two toilets that are not part of my really swanky new area? Oh, I suppose that's actually fair. Uh, thinking about it, yeah, it's probably wise not to go there. You've probably heard of all the times that uh, people have accidentally been peeped on while they've been pooping. That is a bad time. 